and welcome to the Play Nice Podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Andrew Nice Wonder. Uh, today, uh, I'm trying something a little different, doing a solo podcast. Uh, I want to start putting some videos out and uh, just talk about things and get uh, encourage people to check out some of the art that I make. Um, I do comics, cartoons, I play music, and, uh, you know, now I'm a talking head. <laughs> so, uh, and so, yeah, but the reason I'm, uh, or the main reason, I'll go ahead and uh, actually do this up front, that uh, you would be watching this probably is for my book review for uh, Hammer by Jason Krager. Uh, so I'm going to start with that one up up front. Uh, Jason Krager is an uh, artist. He had an Indiegogo campaign um, for a book called Hammer, uh, a post Ragnarok tale. Uh, I was introduced to Jason on uh, Fragtober. Uh, comic book artist Stan Fraga, uh, during the month of October, has this really cool uh, show uh, where he invites other comic book artists or, or other artists. Now, I, I don't necessarily think all of the people that drew throughout the month were comic book artists, uh, but they were artists. Uh, and so, uh, during the month of October, it's also, it's also often called Inktober and, uh, artists will do ink drawings. And so Dan Fraga has a competition called Fragtober where he has other artists come on his YouTube channel and they live stream drawing. And, uh, it's actually, it's a great time. Um, you know, especially if you're a fan of of these guys, like comic book artists. Like I've uh, I've actually been a fan of Dan Fraga's uh, since uh, the you know I was a kid. Like uh, back in the uh, in the '90s, he was uh, um, in with Image Comics at the beginning. Uh, anyway, uh, I'll talk about him later. That's not the point. But anyway, uh, Jason Kreger was one of the artists for Fragtober and. Uh, Super cool, uh, cool guy. Uh, a lot of fun to watch. His drawings were, were great. Um, on uh, the not this is from the finals, but uh, in the in the semifinals, I think I actually uh, voted for him. Uh, his picture was awesome. I don't remember what it was. Uh, it's unimportant. Uh, but anyway, the uh, Fragtober art contest is really cool. And then uh, from there, uh, you know, uh, we ended up following each other on Twitter and he posted out uh, if anyone would like to review his uh, comic Hammer uh, to go for it and I replied and said hello sir I would like to review your comic I didn't really say it like that I don't know that was dumb <laughs> anyway so I uh, so I got it um, I you know been wanting it's been a minute since i've uh read a new comic and uh you know it was, it was exciting i uh whoop, let me see okay good the uh i'm also pressing buttons and changing screens if uh anyway i didn't i need to get the other one set up there we go and so i actually uh got to review hammer uh I sent the pdf over um first off uh I really enjoyed it. Uh, the it, it's very reminiscent of things that uh, I liked uh, when I was younger about comics. It, uh, I'm a huge Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles fan. Uh, the the Eastman and Laird, uh, the Mirage, the black and white uh, stuff. I should have brought it to get a prop. Anyway, uh, I have um, most of the Mirage comics. And, uh, you know, I even have a, uh, Ninja Turtles, uh, tattoo. And, uh, so it r reminds me it's in black and white. Um, uh, and so it, r it reminds me of a lot of the Eastman and Laird and, uh, art, which, you know, I'm a big fan of, uh, black and white. Uh, there, you know, several 
uh, artists and comics that put out stuff in the eighties. It was always super fun. Uh, but, uh, this, uh, comic hammer, uh, well, uh, let's go back here. The, uh, I like his, uh, description uh mad max meets nordic gods in a knockdown drag out fight um which is it which is which is kind of awesome it is uh you know uh exact it is exactly what it says uh it's norse gods meets mad max and uh it, it's uh it's a great it's a good story uh you know it's set up in a post-apocalyptic future uh where you know people are scavengers and uh you know so it's set during uh ragnarok they use a lot of north he uses a lot of norse mythology uh so they actually put a uh glossary in it um which was helpful to go back through when i read it uh you know, because they use a lot of a lot of words, and, and gives the pronunciation uh, for it, which is very helpful. Um, and uh, it follows our hero, uh, Star. She's a scavenger, uh, and she sees this explosion from off, off in the distance and goes to investigate it and uh, finds an artifact and uh, has uh, great power. I, uh, this is, I don't know how spoilery I can get, so I'll try and, uh, <laughs> I'll try and stay away from the, uh, a, a lot of that. But uh, essentially she finds a, a very powerful Norse artifact, uh, a hammer. Um, and it, uh, and shortly after she finds it, she encounters, uh, you know, some trouble and, uh, she gets out of it. And, uh, probably the biggest, uh, my biggest issue, uh, or if I had any complaints was that it, it, it wasn't long enough. <laughs> uh, when it got to the end, I was like, ah, oh, damn, I want to, uh, what happened ne happens next. Uh, so the story is, is very, uh, you know, very engaging for, uh, uh you know, if you di dive head into, uh, this world where, uh, Norse mythology is real and, uh, we are in, you know, these characters are in a, uh, post-apocalyptic future, uh, then this is the book for you. Uh, if you like, um, detailed black and white uh art uh you know i love uh like there's a there's some uh zipatone or duo shade uh in there the uh, uh like the inking is just super it it's it's really cool um i don't know my uh computer is there we go uh you know just the different tones and textures that are in the artwork uh it it's fun to look at like uh regardless of anything else like like the like the pictures just uh you know kind of you know look awesome uh you know especially if you are uh, into uh black and white uh, art so uh yeah uh hammer of gods or hammer of gods uh, the uh hammer uh, by Jason Krager. Uh, this also has a, uh, has a written story, uh, set in the same, uh, set in the same continuity, continuity and universe, uh, which is actually very good, um, about a scavenger, uh, caught in some trouble on his way home and he meets, uh, a very interesting, uh, character that helps him out of a situation and then closing out the book is a short story uh behold star of asgard uh that is by a different artist uh let me go back uh by jay gonzo and uh 
It is a uh, it's a fun little story. It's a fun short story um, about uh, Star uh, trying to uh, help out a village and things. Uh, you know, good twist at the end. Um, the art uh, in this one is also fun. Uh, really nice. Uh, black and white art, uh, good use of Zipatone, uh, do a shade and, uh, it's a fun story. Um, hammer. Uh, I, I highly recommend it. Um, it's a, it's a great read, uh, great art. The, uh, the story is fun. The characters are likable. Um, highly recommend it i uh i will put the uh indiegogo link in the description um as well as jason Kreger's uh twitter and and all of that information so give him a follow and check out hammer on indiegogo uh am i even saying that right yeah <laughs> sounds so weird anyway um I highly recommend the book. Uh, Jason Krager, uh, nice guy, uh, great artist. Um, I can't wait for the next one. Uh, it's going to be great. And uh, thank you guys for listening. And uh, tune in to a, another episode of Play Nice. Thanks for checking out the Play Nice podcast. Uh, I would appreciate it if you would uh, check out my website, trashcanconductor.com. I am an artist. I do uh, cartoons. I've got a fun cartoon called Awkward Ghost Moments. You can check that out there. I've got a uh, adult humored comic, uh, a mature humor comic, uh, Johnny No Pants. Uh, I also do music. Uh, you can uh, get that over on Bandcamp. There's a link to it there. Uh, you can uh, you can also get get merch. I uh, I sell things. I have fun T-shirts, uh, coffee mugs, and things like that. And uh, if you would also like to follow me on any of the social medias, you can find me at Trash Can Conductor. Uh, and there are also links to everything up at the, uh, website, trashcanconductor.com. So thank you much, very much for uh, checking it out. And I hope to see you again soon. Mm -hmm.